What's going on guys, Rodrigo here, Breakfast Club CTG, we back in this beat. Today I wanted to finish off the week with a quick little throwback workout video, guys. This is gonna be more of an isolation back day, so sit back, enjoy the workout. It's a vlog and also kind of just chatting about some of my favorite brands in the fitness space currently. This also took place Christmas week, guys. So something a little bit different, quick little vlog, you know, to kind of get you in your feels, guys. Hopefully it gets you excited to go work out, maybe hit a little bit of isolation, throw in a little bit of functional stuff, a little Metcon breathing piece, you're good to go, guys. If you guys need some inspiration, for that i have plenty of videos on crossfit you know metcon style workouts so go check those out guys if you guys are new here my name is rodrigo i make functional fitness youtube videos guys at least two new videos every week you guys don't want to miss it guys hit that like button hit that subscribe button guys enjoy the throwback vibes today happy friday let's get it guys episode five fitness vlogmas today's gonna be a back day but i'm not gonna do like a raw workout today i think for real this time i think we're gonna go over my top 10 fitness brands and uh share a little bit about why i like them today so if you guys enjoy this episode these are not gonna be in any particular order but we're gonna start off with a few right off the bat with just supplement brands right off the bat one of my newly found top brands has to be pe science particularly their stem free pre-workout high volume love the stuff gives you amazing pumps tastes amazing and uh just very affordable but quality all right so next up has to be one up nutrition absolutely love this company they have so many different products protein powders etc what i particularly fall in love with lately is their bcaas they taste amazing they taste like an actual just candy super delicious super tasty go check them out guys their bcaas are awesome by 1m nutrition not only that but they have a bunch of protein powders vegan protein powders that taste amazing boom go check it out won't hurt your stomach if you're lactose intolerant or you just can't digest whey protein and their whey protein and flavors are next level guys absolutely fire code shots chief for 20 percent off on top of any deals they got going on guys amazing deal go get you some bcas for the booster back day baby let's go all right, number one tip for back here. Mind muscle connection. Low weight, mind muscle connection. It yeah. was very hard for me to find back muscles. Because I said oh, I would probably get 15, but I just don't want to. No. Leave it all here. Train to failure, baby. Check yes. it out. She's got the swag. Matches the watch. Let's go. I didn't even realize. All right, guys. Last and final set. Went 25 25 on each side. Thought I'd show you guys because I was like, oh, I can get 15 of that. I got 15 of this too. So never leave reps that you know you could have got in the tank because you're going to feel like shit. What's the point of being in here? Might as well not even worked out, right? CTG, baby. Let's go. Back onto the whole Gymshark and fitness brands and branding, etc. That's another big reason why, um, why I like the whole just brand and just the message they're sending is because they had all the original like OG fitness 
YouTubers, and at the time I was super into bodybuilding and stuff. Super into just this isolation training and movements, and they had all like the OG badasses on there. Christian Guzman, Mark Fit, Matt Ogis, Jeff Side, a bunch of like the OG people. They were all sponsored by Gymshark. They helped bring Gymshark up and get that break and pop. And so I feel like that's kind of why I was like more inclined to the brand. But yeah, branding man, just, just badass. They do events and stuff. Just the overall branding and message and the community they're building around fitness, super dope. So that's kind of why I like them, even though I'm in a CrossFit and functional fitness now. But like I said, they're stepping into that realm with like the clothing in terms of like performance and making stuff that's not just for, you know, bodybuilding. It's more of like that running and performance aesthetic that they're going for now and as well as like the performance and functionality of the clothes so check them out guys quick little thought on my mind thought i'd spill it out to you guys third exercise today is going to be a wide grip lat pull down you guys have seen this before wide grip lat pull down i'm going to go for four sets actually five sets one warm-up set of 20 the rest working sets of anywhere between 10 to 15 oh yeah third exercise then baby we've been working on the thickness over there so you guys know your boy's trying to get thick damn boy like a thick back i'm not trying to get thick thick now we're trying to get wide I'm trying to get that wide back so we're doing the wide grip lat pull down going heavier on our working sets yeah let's go Set. Next brand is gonna be Rise. You guys have seen me wear this tank top. Other tank tops are very similar to it. But like I said, back to the whole Gymshark branding thing with the OG people, this is Mark Fitz brand. Mark Fitz completely basically out of it. He's all behind the scenes basically. But he was one of the OGs and then just did his own thing. Made sick ass clothing, all based around more of like performancey aesthetic wear is the way I would describe his clothing. Like this tank top, it's like a drop arm tank with a scoop and then like the little split on the side. It's just super sick. I love these. I bought these in every color. But going back to the whole community building aspect of it, super sick community, awesome message, awesome, you know, owner, co-owner. I think the co-owner, co-founder was Tony McAllister, who was also like one of those OG people back in the day training with Mark Fit. So love the brand, love the branding itself, and then just love the whole message and community behind it. Highly recommend you guys go check it out. I have a few tank tops, a few sweaters and hoodies. They're all quality, superior fit, and yeah, just overall great message. So I stole the hoodie. And she stole the hoodie. So. And then this is like the sexiest tank top that shots she owns, guys. You guys heard it here. Ladies, so get this one for your man because it's sexy as fuck. So Literally, not gay. You need to get your lady the, the starter pack. Get yourself one of these tank tops and then order a great hoodie. Because I think <laughs> it's definitely not going to be yours anymore. It's going to be taken, so FYI. No reps left in the tank, baby. No reps left behind. That's the motto, let's start a new movement. No reps left behind. <laughs> mind muscle connection all right so mind muscle connection crossfitters not used to it might not really know what it is basically just close your eyes if you have to it might help 
just literally only think of the muscle you're trying to work. And I feel like that always helps you kind of find it, even if you've never felt it before. Even if you still can't feel it, eventually something will just click there to where like literally you only feel your back working. So give it a go, guys. Gonna do five sets, one warm-up set, four working sets, a 15, just nice stretch and squeeze. Working on that whole contraction mind-muscle connection. Let's get it. Take one. <laughs> Last and final exercise is gonna be a straight arm lat push down with the easy bar. We don't have a straight bar that's like wide enough, so we went the easy bar by going overhand right here, boom. If you get tired, you can always wrap your thumb under, give you a little bit more grip. I like to stay up here as much as I can with the whole no rep left behind movement that we're starting here. My last three sets, honestly, I forgot to count, but I only stopped until I couldn't go anymore. And right now I counted and I did 15 reps. So I definitely have been doing over 15 reps. Those other sets just goes to show guys, you guys have more left in the tank and there's uh, pros and cons to that. Sometimes you might not count your reps and you're going until you can't go anymore, but you might not be doing enough reps or like a goal amount of reps that you can do. You might just not mentally be pushing yourself. Other times when you count the reps, you still have left, more left in the tank, but you don't keep pushing it because you hit your amount of reps. I've just been like not counting and going until I can't do them anymore. And I hit 15 on that, but I could feel that I was coming close to failure. So no rep left behind, baby. It's a movement. Let's start it. Hashtag it, tag me. Let's go. holiday season Christmas week just want to say Merry Christmas to all you guys Merry holidays happy holidays whatever you guys want to call it whether or not you celebrate this time of year just enjoy this time of year with family friends enjoy good foods do your cardio drink your water stick to your routine and have that balance guys we're in this for the long term we're in this for the long haul it's a lifestyle guys so take advantage there's only one time a year that you guys get to do things like this so take full advantage I'm definitely gonna be chugging crispy boys with the boys whenever they're back in town starting probably tomorrow shout out Kui. but yeah just gonna enjoy this time as a year catch you guys back home for the rest of the brands all right guys so the next company I want to talk to you guys about is Xworks. As you guys have seen them in other videos, the early vlog videos, um, Xworks, Joe and Grow. Grow is their whey protein, grass fed, amazing, superior quality protein. Um, put it in my coffee, called the Joe and Grow. Awesome, phenomenal. Try it out. I promise you won't regret it. Tastes like warm hot chocolate, especially during the winter months. If you want to kick it up a notch, throw a little bit of CBD drops in there for added little taste and recovery money combo anyways xworks is awesome i love their branding it's just super neutral it's just it's just hard it's hard branding it's xworks uh, has an x super minimal and like black um their instagram aesthetic and athletes are all just badasses it's all just super sick and that's why i like it basically um they have a few products they have um lift which is their creatine supplement and grow which is their whey protein they have ignite which is their pre-workout i've never tried it because i'm not doing caffeine but i've tried to lift and grow phenomenal they also have cbd drops which i've tried and they're awesome as well as well as their rub which is their cbd menthol recovery rub awesome for my back and shoulder when i was having pains and aches i was blown away by it honestly but x works is one of those companies that's you know differentiating themselves with like their aesthetic their branding and just their overall like mission it's just super sick it's clean simple and their quality is superior they're still an up-and-coming brand 
but I've been behind them since I found out about them and absolutely love their products. Go check them out, guys. Tell them Shots G sent you. Hopefully, we get a discount code in 2021, baby. Let's go. It's GY the Creepy Ghost Vibes. Well, it's like 6.30 in the morning and everyone in my house is sleeping. So I hope I didn't wake them up. I'll see you guys next clip. All right, guys. So the next company I want to talk to you guys about is a shorts company. Today, the weather decided to lighten up in my hometown right around 60 degrees. So I decided to throw on shorts. I also decided to go get myself a fresh haircut because you guys saw earlier and all day today, the crazy hairdo because it was just all over the place. Check out the haircut. Your boy got a fresh fade. More than usual, guys. Like this is like new for me. Um, anyways, decided to wear shorts because shorts are just like easy, you know, to go get a haircut in. They brush off your shorts. All the little hairs come off super easy. And yeah, and that company is going to be 10,000 gear. So check out the shorts I'm wearing, guys. 10,000. 10,000 here. You got a nice little pocket there. Another little zipper pocket there. Perfect. Threw my earbuds in there. Wasn't worried about them getting thrown away. The waistband is super nice and reinforced. Um, also has liner inside of it, which is really awesome. And then these slits right here, so it doesn't get in the way when you're squatting. Guys, I absolutely love these shorts and I love this brand. I bought the interval short in the shorter inseam, which is about seven inches, I believe. It sits just above the quad. Perfect, guys, I absolutely love this short. I bought literally every color in this short. Um, one of the most durable pairs of shorts that I've ever bought. Super comfortable, super high quality, and for the price, it's unmatched, guys. They are a little bit on the pricier side. They're on the medium, low, high-end side in terms of price range. They're definitely cheaper than Lulu, but they definitely compare, if not better, than the Lulu stuff and Lulu shorts. So, yeah, guys, that's another brand that I really like. I really like the message, the aesthetic, and the vibe that they're giving off. They're all just rugged, functional fitness, cross fitty style clothing. They have joggers, they have shirts. I've personally only tried their shorts in you know, to be exact, their interval short with the liner and their combat short with a liner. If you guys are gonna get some of these shorts, I recommend the liner, guys. White waist underwear, the liner keeps you nice and compressed. It doesn't feel uncomfortable. Um, and yeah, guys, super comfortable. Love the vibe, love, you know, the message they're sending. Their motto's like better than yesterday. I absolutely love it, guys. There's one brand you guys gotta go check out right now. It's 10,000, go check them out. All right, guys, so the last and final brand that I wanna talk to you guys about, honestly saving the best for last, is Virus International. Now, I don't have any virus here on me, but you guys have seen it plenty on this channel. I even have like two or three dedicated videos to reviews and hauls on them, testing out the gear. Absolutely just amazing quality. This stuff is the definition of performance wear at leisure. It looks super dope if you're running errands, super functional, but the, the quality is amazing. It's super comfortable. It does the job insanely well. Not only that, but it looks really, really good. You don't look dorky in it. It looks amazing. It performs amazing. And I just absolutely love the product itself. Not only that, but the whole branding around it, the whole company. Basically, it's like mission statement, the passion that defines you. Super awesome. Their Instagram feed is super sick. It just kind of goes with the whole brand feel and kind of how they want you to wear and style their clothes. Super amazing, guys. And that's what I'm going to leave you guys with today. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode of Vlogmas, episode six. Go ahead and hit that like button, that subscribe button, guys. New videos every single week and a new video every day until the end of the year, guys. So I hope you guys uh, are liking these videos. Don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Instagram, guys. Stay tuned for tomorrow's episode. Breakfast Club, CTG, we out the speed.